everyone. For those who don't know me, I'm Julia Nicole. Thanks for watching my videos. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Today we are going to be doing a what's in my makeup bag challenge. So make sure you keep watching. So first things first, let's get right into it. This is my makeup bag. Yeah, it is the size of a purse, kind of. It's a lot bigger than a normal makeup bag, but you know, I like makeup. So I got my makeup bag from TJ Maxx and I have been using it for I think a little bit over two weeks or so. I just recently bought this and I bought it for $10. I don't think it was on sale but I could be completely wrong. Um, it is this marble print and it has one large pocket that zips and then it has a little one on the back of it that also zips shut. Inside there's four pockets and one large huge pocket. Inside this one is only one pocket, but yeah. On here it says Isabella Scott and underneath in little lettering it says Sydney. So I believe that is the brand. I might go check it out later because I really want like a bunch more of these. But um, let's go ahead and start. When I first open it up, this is what it looks like. There's one, two, three, four pockets and then one huge big one. So let's start off with what you guys see first. So yes, of course, this is my Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette inside my makeup bag. Everyone knows that this is a huge palette and it fits inside my makeup bag. So that is the number one reason why I love this bag. Also in this little pocket thing I have here, I have a headband, so this is my everyday little pull my hair back makeup headband. I also have another palette in here. I just have my Kat Von D Shading Light palette. That fits in there perfectly. And then before we get into the pockets that I have in here, I'm just going to go through this little one and show you what's in here, this little zip on the side. So in here I have a ton of mascaras. I have my Stila Huge Lash. That one is like one of my favorites. I have to go buy the actual big brand of it. Um, I also have my Better Than Sex Too Faced Mascara. I have a mini travel size one because before I had this bag, I had little travel size in a little bag. I also have my Maybelline Great Lash Mascara. That's also a travel size. And then I have um, some new Maybelline mascara. I think I saw it on YouTube to try it, and I really don't like it, but it's in there. Um, I also have 600 eyeliners. In case anyone needs eyeliner, I have a ton of them on the go. I have three NYX um, matte liquid eyeliners. I use these every day, though, so... Those ones are my favorite. And then I have two of these that came in an Ipsy that my boyfriend's mom gave to me. So those ones I think are called I Ico London, I believe. And they're just simple liquid black eyeliners. Also in this pocket I have my ABH Brow Wiz and Brow Definer. And I prefer the Brow Wiz over the Brow Definer, but... I still have them both in there just in case. I also have um, two lash glues. I have my Aridel one and a Duo one in there, just a mini, because you never know on the go when you're going to need some lash glue. So that is it for that pocket. Let's go into these four pockets. So first things first, let's go to this one because this is basically like my primer and stuff but all right so I have a mini on the go Too Faced Hangover RX primer this is my favorite one of all time I use this every single day so I need to have that on the go with me I also have a mini professional um, primer I don't use this one as often that's why it's just a mini one I think this is the only one I have I had a larger one before, but I think I used it, so I just got that mini one. I have my Mario Badescu Cucumber and Green Tea Spray. 
I also have my Milani foundation. I don't use this one as often, but it's still a really good foundation. I love it. I also have my Urban Decay All Nighter foundation. This one is almost empty as you can see, but I use this every single day. This is like my favorite one. I recommend it to everyone. Okay, so across from that one is my makeup remover pocket, I guess you could call this. But this is my Neutrogena makeup wipes. These ones are the only ones I can use on my face because I'm super sensitive. So these are the bomb ones. I love them. I, I also have my micellar. I think this is Garner. This is, I have the larger one with me at home. And I put it in a nail polish bottle, and that sounds crazy, but let me find it free. So I put it in this, and I use, this is also in my makeup bag, but I use these little cotton pads, and just like you would take off nail polish, I would pump this down and then wipe my face with it, which is like the best thing ever. You can pick these up. I know I got mine at the dollar store, actually, so best purchase ever for a dollar. So I have those two things in my makeup bag, too. So, moving along to my bottom half here, I have my NAC Prime Prep Fix Plus. This one has makeup all over it for some reason, I don't really know why. But I throw this one in my makeup bag, I usually use my Urban Decay, I think it's All Nighter Spray, but this one has a little lock on it. So when it's in my bag, it never sprays, which I really, really love. I think that's the greatest thing ever. So I have that in there. I also have my Lori Geller bronzer. Because you never know when you're going to need a bronze. But then I also, that's Sister Medium. That's like my favorite. Um, and then I have a Too or not Too Faced. It's a Tarte um, mini blush, and it's in the shade Party. I got this along with... Uh, lipstick for my birthday from Sephora and I just threw it on the ground. Alright, so that is that for that pocket. Next to that one is a mess. So in this pocket, this is my lipstick pocket. So here is actually the Tarte um, lipstick that came with that from Sephora for my birthday. I also have my Urban Decay Meltdown. This is a lipstick remover. I recommend it. It's one of the best things ever. I picked this up by accident and now I am in love with it. So, Also in this pocket I have, I don't know why I do this, but I guess I just buy things in threes, but this, I have three of the same shade, same Tape Shape Concealer, all are fair, I promise, look at all fair, I just throw three in there, so unnecessary, but for some reason, I gotta do it. Once again, here I go, I have two Too Faced Born This Way Concealers, these are both in the shade Very Fair, why I have them in there, I don't really know, I don't even use those anymore. I also have, I have one of these, but I have my... Naked Skin Concealer. I only use this one when I pair it with my Naked um, Skin Foundation from Urban Decay. So, I don't really know why that's in there. I also have um, an LA Colors Auto Lip Pencil, and this is in the shade Nude. So, I use that a lot. And then I also have... I have four ABH matte lipsticks. These are like my four favorite ones. I just throw these in my bags whenever. The three of them are nudes, so yeah. I'll just go through the colors for you. This one is catnip. This is like a really pretty dark wintry color. I don't wear this one all that often, just when I'm feeling very adventurous. Um, then I also have this one in Ashton. This is 
a really pretty pretty one I swatched it in the store and had to get it and I haven't even used it on my lips yet so hopefully it looks good on my lips but then I have this one this is my favorite one of all time everyone should get this color because I think it looks good on everyone it is my naked naked one and then I have this one this one's really light for me I usually mix this one or put it on the inside of my lips when I use a dark color so it creates like a little gradient but this one is called milkshake and that is it for my whole makeup bag that is completely empty so if you guys want to see more videos like this please comment down below tell me what you want to see thanks for watching my video and i'll see you guys next time bye